A pro-Palestinian encampment went up at the University of Vermont over a week ago, and protesters say UVM officials have met two of their five demands. On Friday, the school's president officially addressed the demonstration. President Shuresh Shares Garamella says, quote, while I am grateful to the students and university leaders who have engaged in conversations, I note the demonstration has been continuously in violation of university policies since its inception. Regrettably, appropriate student conduct processes have been initiated. The statement later goes on to say, our planned speaker, Ambassador Linda Thomas-Greenfield, will not be joining us to deliver the commencement address. As Fox 44's Matt Holderman reports, that cancellation was one of the demands. We are feeling cautiously optimistic. Walking around UVM's Andrew Harris Commons right now is a memorable experience, to say the least. Calls for ceasefire written in chalk beneath your feet as you're surrounded by hundreds of cardboard signs and about 60 to 70 tents. It's all being led by students who say they want their university to cut any ties it might have with entities that might be contributing to the Israel-Hamas war. We are not here to, to fight or do anything like that. We're here to... Make, get the message out. A lot of the protesters won't show their faces on camera in fear of retaliation, knowing other campus demonstrations around the country have been met with violence this past week. Despite that, they're still pushing university leaders to meet their demands, which include UVM divesting from weapons manufacturers, carrying out academic boycotts of Israeli institutions, and promising all students a pardon once the encampment is over. Currently with academic consequences, we've had some, thre some threats, but we are we think we still are on good terms with them and we are still we are still hard at work in negotiations. While those three demands still haven't been fulfilled, they say the university is granting two of their wishes, sharing info with them about where they're investing endowment dollars, along with canceling UN Ambassador Linda Thomas Greenfield's upcoming commencement speech. Although it's not clear if the university canceled her speech due to the encampment or due to other reasons. With the semester coming to a close in just two weeks, students say they haven't officially decided if they'll continue their camp into the summer or not, but for now, they say they're they're not going anywhere. What happens this what happens with the summer is going to be ultimately a decision for all of us to make. We're currently saying we're going to be here until our demands are met. In Burlington, Matt Holderman, Fox 44 News.